You know, I, I, I guess I do a lot of different things, um, you know, because I, I have a solo career and a career with the quartet, and I teach, you know, here at USC, and I have a wife and daughter, and um, try to be involved in some other things. I'm actually on the board of directors of the Guitar Foundation of America, and, um, you know, I, I don't think of myself as being completely stressed out and bu over, overly busy all the time. I guess I tend to compartmentalize pretty well, you know, um, or multitask pretty well. Um, but every once in a while it catches up with me. You know, it, it's, you know, I, I just played uh, at the Guitar Foundation of America convention and I, I was on the jury for the competition for three days and I had to go to board meetings and I was driving my daughter to school in the morning and then, and I was rehearsing this new concerto and, and when I got up on stage to play my solo concert at the end of the week I was like, how does this stuff go again? <laughs> you know, so I think that one caught up with me a little bit. But for the most part, um, I just try to, I guess I've always been really good at um, knowing what my deadlines are. You know, I, I, in fact, I do really well with deadlines and I, I'm terrible if I don't have a deadline. Like for me, if I didn't have any gigs at all, I wouldn't kind of know what to do with myself. You know, it's like, well, what am I supposed to practice for exactly? But it's like, well, I have to practice this piece because I have to play it in two weeks. And uh, I think setting goals for myself and setting deadlines for myself, it gives me of something tangible and concrete. And I, I do have a sense of what I need to do to, to be prepared, you know, to, to be comfortable stepping on stage or coming to teach.